Hi, I just wanted to do a quick video on uh, rat cages and rat care. Um, a lot of people have problems. Uh, their rats end up with respiratory problems. And also uh, rats can get uh, different types of parasites like mites and fleas and lice. Uh, been there, done it, not fun. Anyways, um, for years now, I've been... Um, completely rid of any type of parasites because I no longer use cedar chips or pine bedding. Those are like the two of the worst things you can do as far as getting uh, parasites and also for respiratory problems. I just wanted to show you my cage setup. Um, basically I use pee pads. They're for dogs and what I do is I cut them to fit um, the pen. As you can see the rats they, um, at first they used to chew them, but they get used to them and they'll last anywhere from two to three weeks depending on if your rats are potty trained. If they're potty trained, um, they'll last up to three weeks. Uh, a lot of times they go fishing for blueberries and when they do that, um, sometimes the blueberries can stain them and I vacuum it every day. Um, but uh, yeah, it, it, depending on how clean your rats are, they can last up to three weeks, but usually I change them every two. So, and they end up costing the pee pads, if you could get them, uh, the, what they call the original wee pads, they usually cost like $50, $60 for 100 pads. Very expensive, but if you go to um, Sam's Club, you can pick up a box of 120, and I can get uh, 20 changes out of them. And it equals one dollar per change. So it's a good way to uh, keep your rats clean. But they're only as clean as you keep your cage. So anyways, uh, I just wanted to show you my little girls. There's little Comet. That one's Comet. And that one's Stormy. And Misty is down here hiding somewhere. Hi, Misty. There's my little Misty. Hi, girl. All right. Well, I hope this helps you out a bunch. Um, all right. Take care.